hexagonal prism regular. This is the hexagonal prism, six sides and the uh, same shape the full way along. We're given an XY line and we're asked to draw the plan looking directly down on it in this position. We need to know what angle it is between the pencil and the side here. There are six sides, so we divide 360 divided by 6 is 60 degrees. So this angle here is 60 degrees. So we have a 60 degree set square, so we will use it to draw down at the angle. And the same the other side. Now using the compass set to the length of the line mark off the distance and the same on the other side and mark off the last one now and then just line in that hexagon And that's the plan complete. That's looking directly down on it now. So there we are there now. We're asked to draw the elevation looking at 90 degrees to the XY line. So this is the view we'll see here. We're going to see this surface the front and this at the right hand side and the left hand side so project the lines up from the plan and your height as the red arrow points out mark that height and line in your drawing and that's the elevation complete and there it is now Now we're given this XY line here and we're asked to project out from the plan. So again, we'll be projecting at 90 degrees to the XY line. We're looking across in the direction of the arrow. So the view we see when we look at it across is that there. We just see two surfaces in this case. It's this surface and this one here. Now, to do that, we project the lines across and using the height that we took above here, step it out here and draw that line vertically up and proceed to line in your drawing. That's your drawing complete now. There's the plan as we had it. Looking at it in that direction, so there we have it there now. So you have the blue surface and the black surface. We're given a new X Y line of 45 degrees here. And we are asked to project the plan up and find the new elevation. So we again look at 90 degrees to the XY line, which is at 45 degrees. So if we look along that arrow, this is what we expect to see. We'll see these three surfaces, the red one, the black one and the blue green one. Now these two lines at the back won't be visible. So we have projected the lines up. The height we take as before, marked up here, and draw your line across. Parallel with the XY line. And that there is the top of the prism.
Now the points we'll see, we'll see this one here, this one, this one, and this one. We will not see these back points here. So project the lines up and line in the lines that we can see first. And then there's the two dotted lines at the back. And that's the drawing complete. And now just to look at the view that we see now. The red, the black and the blue surface. And behind the two dotted lines to represent these two lines at the back that cannot be seen. And that's why they're in dotted lines. Now we're given this x, y line and we ask to project from the elevation. So project down from this view here. Now that's the way we drew down the lines at 30 degrees. The distances that we take now is the distances in the plan. So these distances here and we step them off on a piece of paper, it's the handiest way. So mark X, Y line here and point one, two and three. Now place the slip of paper with the XY point on the XY line and mark the three points, one, two and three. And now draw those lines parallel with the XY line. So that's the three lines drawn. And now to choose the points. The top point is there in the plan. I'm using two pencils here. So it's on number two. So I follow it down and go to number two and mark that point there. The top point is shown in the plan and these two positions which is on point line one and line three so project down and mark it on line one and on line three the next point shown here in the plan it's on one and on three so again follow down from the elevation and mark it on one and on three and the last point it's on two, now project it down and mark it on number two. Now line that in and that's the top of the prism sitting at the angle. This is the way we were projecting down. So we have the arrow here. So now we're going to look directly along that arrow. That's what we will see there. So we have drawn in the top surface of the prism here. That's it there. And now we're going to see the green surface and the pink surface. To get those points now we take down the base of the prism. So first points on number two. Point one and three. So bring that point down to point one and three. And next one is on one and three again. And the last point is on two and marked there. And now lining your complete prism those dotted lines there are hidden you cannot see those 
and that's it completed. Now there's one back line that cannot be seen there at the very top so it will be a dotted line along there and that's your drawing complete. Now that's it coloured in so now to look at it again the way we set out so look along the arrow there's what we see there so you have your three surfaces and that's hexagonal prisms complete.